What's up? Let's do this bonkers. All right, yep, we're live on Twitch. And Seemingly, we're also live on YouTube. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So listen, you don't want me singing our nighttime song to them, do you? Because you'll die laughing. I'm good. Yeah. He doesn't want his lullaby. You could just hit tell me to hit tweet. God damn. We're so freaking possessive. Also Here, uh, compose me a tweet that puts out my Twitch address. No. Anyways, while the Lady Columbia is composing tweets, <clears throat> um, welcome to... Uh... <laughs> I can't stop myself. Just do the intro, goddammit. Welcome to the Date Night Dumpster, uh, which is going to be our working title for our bad movie night reactions. Um, this is something that we do as our own little date night in general. Um, it is, it is. And uh, we thought we might share share some of that with you, the people, while you're all locked up with coronavirus at home. Uh, now, where's your Twitch link? I just type it out. Twitch.tv backslash Great Pirates Home. So proud. No, just so that like, oh, you guys are calling you calling me a jerk now. Yeah. So, uh, <sighs> what we do, we've mentioned this before, but what we do is um, we have a criteria. Nothing that's been on best of the worst or good, bad, 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 or any other similar. Nothing. Nothing well, on MST. Uh, we only limit it to the things we actually watch too. We don't like. I'm not going to go scouring the internet for every review show to make sure they've not done it. Like, right, sure. So it's primarily those three that, that they can't have appeared on. Um, and then our criteria sort of for finding them is we go on IMDb and we search for low-rated movies uh, in different genres and pick around. Now, today, that's not exactly how we ended up with this one. I was looking through some of those and found... Oh, normally it's me. I find them. I found a movie that looked interesting that I think was called like Dragon Fury or something like that. Um, and I was looking on YouTube. I, I wanted to find something that was on YouTube for like free, basically. Um, so I was looking on YouTube for it and I didn't find it, but I found some other movie called City Dragon. And we watched like two seconds of it and it looked amazing. So yeah, so we just started to we just yeah. decided like, yeah, all right, we're doing this. So this appears to be some sort of a mid 90s martial arts action flick. Uh, we know nothing really more about it than that, and uh, we're gonna start it up now. Mm, I'm gonna be eating this pop like it's bad. I made this popcorn for us, but it's really for me. Hit that play button, baby. And this movie's gonna be beautiful like a peacock. Smooth sailing all the way. <laughs> filthy, filthy, filthy. Related to filthy Frank. MC, MC Kung Fu. All That's right. Fucking great. So I believe this is a 1995 classic. Mm -hmm. Filthy Phil. Mm -hmm. 
Millicent Alley. You have two first names. That's not right. Millicent is my name. <clears throat> it is. For who? For 19th century British women. I bet you did a great job, Scott. Yo, yo, this is me shoving popcorn in my face for the next 15 minutes, so fuck all y'all. I can't stand the rain. Kiss my window. Very good, baby. <clears throat> Filthy Phil's just got his dirty little hands all over this. Mm -hmm. Also, did his parents hate him to name him Phil Phillips? You're back. Uh -oh. Here we go, right into the action. That was two tops. You're a bit, dude. Are they? Are they in? Are they in Taco Face? Pause it for a second. Dude. We should probably like check our sound mixing. I don't know how we sound over the video. How do I do that? Go to YouTube. Uh, last one. I don't know how we sound over the video. Get to the point where they're talking. Hey, are they? Are they? In, are they in Taco Face? Let's hear them. Pause it for a second. Dude. The action. That was too tough. You got fed, dude. You got fed. Five minutes ago. Uh, I'm watch this. Fuck the keys, Holmes. Give me motherfucking keys. Drop them. Drop those motherfuckers. What did I stutter? So the drop those motherfuckers. Take your motherfucking head off, fool. Drop them. <laughs> Still grabbing weird overalls, bro. Test drive. Sugar, do I got a sweet tooth for you? Is that right? That's some fine green screen you guys got there. Mm-hmm. Sugar, you so sweet. 
Diabetes couldn't stop me from overdosing on you. That's terrible. Oh, yeah. Um, is that your Corvette out there? So, what is your name? Ray. But my friends call me Cream. <laughs> Cream? Why? Nah. Why? They call me Cream because I have a knack for mixing with sugar. And the mixture makes for a very long night. Mm. Hey, man, I'm not white. I'm a nigga. A white nigga. Uh, oh. <laughs> a brother. Oh, I'm Lord. Oh, was it? I'm sorry. <laughs> I was not entirely prepared for what just happened. Would you Would you like to relate it to the audience in case they didn't catch it? No, not particularly. Would you? Nope. No, I would not. I will play that back for y'all one time. I'm gonna just let I'm gonna let that happen because I don't have. Oh, night. I'm not repeating them words. Hey, man, I'm not white. I'm a nigga, a white nigga, <laughs> a brother that happened to be dipped in vanilla. It's a brother that happened to be dipped in vanilla, baby. As you can clearly tell from his flannel shirt. Very stylish. I was also like, I, I almost missed this scene because I was reacting to the last one with our our heroes like ridiculous fucking overacting faces and like. Mm, I mix the sugar <laughs> so good. <laughs> Thanks for long nights. <laughs> I'll let you all know. I'm so proud to be the girlfriend to live in the grip on his own. <laughs> Just throwing it out there. <laughs> well, and the look, the look on this black man's face is like, you don't pay me enough for this. <laughs> they do not steal oh, black yeah, yeah. man. That's a scam. That's a scam. And my buddy old pal, my buddy old pal. Today, Mr. Agent over here just won the lottery of bodaciousness. A bucks and bombs, child, that'll make your head spin. A ten plus, I'm telling you, this lovely turkey is a smorgasbord ready to be caught. This is gonna that be was the line. So. Yeah. That was the line that I heard. I said, no, we're watching this. Yep. This is this is what we popped in on as I was skipping through the movie. You were going to say something? This has to be Filthy Phil. I bet. Yeah. Um, Do you feel like he's a comedian or something? Or Yeah, something like that. I feel like he's like the only white comedian on Def Jam and he's like mm. playing it up. Not only is she cute, but she I feel like he was a YouTuber before YouTube was a thing. Juicy root the boot. Sounds like a piece for the piece. <laughs> what? Hey, that line about cream worked out real good. Mixing with sugar. This is a terrible, terrible movie. <laughs> um, I think I better slip in some. What bedroom are they in? The bedroom at the club? Yep, the club bedroom. Because you can still hear the club sounds. Back to the brick house, Van G.I. Joe. After lover, she be asking for a little more. Gonna moan and groan like you never dream. Just another notch, bet, post scheme. Play those advantages in a gym, room, mad life. Won't look at my eyes and you will not wanna fight. I saw slowly from your soft and loaded feet. An hour later, we be butt naked in the sheet. Van, Van, Van J. Van, Van, Van J. Oh, baby, what can I say? Loves to look lingerie. So, when you're like clean in the sick. bathroom before we have sex or whatever, are you rapping to yourself? Mm -hmm. All the time. Uh -huh. This hole is so easy. Like, no offense. I'm all for sleeping around, but like. You gotta earn it. You can't just be coming up with weird pickup lines about cream and things like that. Pitay, Benji, and me. 
Making love, girl, we got it on. Two days straight, now I must be gone. That look in your eyes gives me a scary feeling. That's relationship. That's why I'm peeling. <laughs> Are you? See ya, Ray. Just pump that and dump this bitch. Fuck. That Ray just pumped it. That nigga just pumped and dumped. Like, that's our hero, y'all. Well, I do remember reading something about him. Bye, like, mama. Like mama. Sweet apple pie. Excuse me? Ain't you got a round back stack on your back? Is that supposed to be a compliment? Oh, yes. Call me cool or call me back. But I'd like to thank your daddy and your mammy for giving you such a kick ass. This thing just said mammy? Mm hmm. Is this whole movie just going to be him going around picking up different broths? Yes. All right. Whatever. Is that your Corvette over there? I guess that means that you've got a lot of money, though. Oh, yes, I got cash. To own a Corvette? Mm -hmm. They're not that expensive. Also, why does everyone assume it's his Corvette? I mean, it is, but like... Also, hey, random man in the parking lot, is that your Corvette over there? Also, like, listen, I know the old line, like, vets get you wet, but, like, no. No. A man's driving, like, you know, a fucking, a G, you know, a G55, and be like, is that your G55 over there? Like, that's, okay, yeah, that's gonna get me a little wet. Okay, dude's rocking like a real nice, like decked out, in package fucking BMW station wagon. I'm gonna be fucking what? You're a different sort of lady. But like, sorry, I don't understand. Google, you don't need to understand, honey. You're good. You're good. Sorry, I can't help with that yet. No, you can't. The mic's off. Yeah, honey. It is now. <laughs> um. Yes, darling. But I'm not about to get wet over somebody's American station. Over somebody's American ass Corvette. Oh, you don't love America? I don't love Corvette. Communist. Yeah. Excuse me. Okay, I don't know what I just did. You want to be over there. Okay. How about we go out, honey? Sorry, Donald Trumpet, but this lady ain't no puppet. And it's gonna take a lot more than good looks and a big fat wallet to get into my watch call it. Don't need Don't to work. Yeah. I'm in <laughs> That's sweet. Thank you. Is everyone gonna rap at each other in this? Only the yeah. best. For such a lovely princess. <laughs> Everybody you don't waste any time, do you? Also, okay. Oh, wow. Full frontal nudity. Scale blonde lady was fine with whipping out her tits. Yeah. Getting scale. Wholesale Kim Fields, not so much. Yeah, discount Kim Fields was not about that way. Movie is an extended music video. Brace yourselves, ladies, ladies. Hit with cut three brothers, crazy. Stupid, stupid, do it, fight you. Let them come from shakers, fight you. Acting cool, don't wanna blow it. Trick it, chicks, but they don't know it. Jealous boyfriends love they who say, but I don't care, they can kiss my booty. Cousin Vicky for coming here with me to check out what the agent. Yeah, well this agent. What was that? An editing mistake. <laughs> I don't. I don't know. We just. We just went from one scene. We just went from like sex scene. We went from like okay, so we went from like flirting in a parking lot. 
Right. Instantly to a sex scene. No yes. build up. <clears throat> that lasted for like two seconds. Just so we could see tits. And then instantly to a fucking music video. With like groupies and he's like up Oh, there. we just showed tits on YouTube. Oh, yeah. Oops. <laughs> I didn't know that was going to happen, guys. Mm. Well, it's a good thing I'm already demonetized. Yeah. Seems too good to be true. I'm going to drill him with a few questions and see if he's full of shit. <laughs> Girls, <laughs> this is filthy. Uh, I mean, filth. I heard that. So, big game. Rick didn't tell me you'd be this juicy. You got a big, fat booty. Hey, I heard enough. I need some air. Oh, Cherry, <laughs> she'll be okay. So will you. Uh, oh, great. Now with an agent, I can get work. I don't, th what is this? I don't. I don't know. Are they posing as, like, like, because there's no setup to this, I don't know if they're, like, posing as modeling agents or modeling agents. Like, I have no clue what's happening. Are they models? Are they actresses? They're models. How do we know that? Because she said at the beginning of this scene, this lady said, oh, well, you know, I want to come along with you see if this modeling thing is bullshit. Also, so we're going to have to do some voodoo here. Why is that? I'm gonna need you to bring bring my rolling table over here. No, that not that one. It's behind you that way. And the tobacco. And just if I could get it under the thing, that would be good. Look at him work, y'all. Look at him work. Real sexy man. Working working for the weekend. Let's see what we can do here. I am covered in popcorn. Yes, you are. It's all over the late night bear suit. Yep. Yep. Dude. Now hand me some, hand me that back over there, baby. Sorry, y'all. We <coughs> we didn't. I, I've been rolling cigarettes like individually because I'm lazy. Dude, don't don't shake your head to my laziness. Keep your head steady, bro. Park while you're a wigger. <laughs> what does that mean? I think you know. Go on, you're the white one. You got to say it. No, I don't. <laughs> yeah, you do. Hello, Imperator Yvette. My Imperator, how are you? All right, let's let's continue along with the movie. I like need a cigarette. This is a lot. Why are you following me? I can't stand you. You're such a prince. You're a street urchin. You're a librarian. You look like buckwheat. Don't go there. Your feet's too big. Your mouth's too big. Are you as turned on as I am? I'm glad you survived in quarantine. We're barely doing that. Okay. Clearly, like, this was ad-libbed. Because mm -hmm. she didn't know what to say to him. She was making weird faces, too. She's like, you look like buckwheat. <laughs> Your mouth too big. Um, now they're about to like do it in an alley. Like, this is a lot. More. <laughs> oh, taxi. Um, do you have any tests left? No more tests today. I'm done. Yo, with Tina. Tina. Hey. It just keeps going. It's fast over social media. I, I, no, no, I no fucking. Yeah, look, no establishment. Talk to you a second about that. I thought I asked you. I don't want you hanging out with that oversexed bin bet, remember? Vicky is my best friend. Can I have girlfriends? Jeez, I can't be with you all the time. Hey, hey, come on. Let's go do something. No, just go already. I just baby some interracial God, love. You're smothering me. I need fucking air. fighting like crazy. Yeah. You know something? You got a big fucking mouth. You got a big fucking mouth and you got to learn to shut it. Now you're the woman and I'm the man. You get that straight? Yeah. Or else. Or else what? No, Yvette, this is not a porno. Oh, Lord. No, there were some boobs a little while ago. We weren't expecting that. You just be thankful there are people around. And he's already beating her? Like. You better be here. This is supposedly a martial arts movie. Oh! So we've seen what? like two seconds a of martial arts. In so the ass. He reminds me of a little puppy. 
Poor thing needs a life. I wish you'd get lost. You could do better than that. I just want to leave him. But I can't because he's white. Your, ass, huh? your money. Yeah. I don't think I'm in love with anyone. I mean, there's a limit to everyone. He's still kicking. Poor thing needs a life. Is this a Big movie? I don't know. I wish you'd get lost. Maybe. You could do better than that. I just want to leave him. He's still kicking your ass, huh? Yeah. I don't think I'm in love with anyone. I mean, there's a limit to everyone. Ah! All right, here we go. Back to the martial arts. I am. You can't. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying, Imperial Army. What the fuck is happening? How do you go from this, like, see, with some emotional gravitas to, like, this? One, two, three. We home dogs getting busy. Knocking boots, we make girls dizzy. Three of us having a ball. So many women will have them all. Oh. How old you gotta be? Hi. Hi. I saw you feeling down, so I thought I'd come around and cheer you up. <laughs> this is our hero. This is our hero, and like he just slept Ladies with her best the friend. Should be happy. Was that the same girl? Be. Yes. Thank you, Pet. I'm okay. Such lovely eyes. Shouldn't try to lie. Okay. If a guy, whatever you're into, um, a woman, a non-binary human being came to you and was speaking entirely in rhyme, you would be calling the police. <laughs> Are you the Baron Arconan? You know. Are you? What is happening? <laughs> All right, really? Uh, I didn't get your name. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm Tina. And yours? Ray. Ray. Yeah. Oh, sure. Sit down. And Ray isn't particularly attractive. Like, He's you were checking me out too, huh? Well, I guess I was a little. I know beauty and chemistry when I see it. He's a weird face. You sure are confident, aren't you? How do you come up with those clever lines so quick? Oh, it's a gift. Oh, they're clever now. Like your beauty. <laughs> oh, you think so? <laughs> oh, indubitably. <laughs> What do you say to some dining, some dancing, some sweet romancing? You know, I really don't get out much. Good. Hard work and no play keeps the wolves away. Persistent, aren't we? <laughs> Did David Serini direct this? I'll huff and I'll puff and I'll No, because you can see it and hear it! Persistent, aren't you? So, no, no, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, Dragon Imperial Man, but No, I, this isn't a Reed production. He may have wrote the script, guy. though. Actually, no, he what probably say? didn't. Let's hit it. He's disgusted by us browns. I don't know. I and he wouldn't... See, Irini would not have written a white character to be the, the villain. Mm, no, definitely not. He also... <sighs> These women don't have a lot of agency, but they have more than Irini would probably give them. Yeah. We have chemistry. Well... What? Now that I <laughs> was that her like just desperately trying to fight off her insatiable attraction to to our hero? Like, <laughs> <laughs> now she just started to look like this was this is her. Huh? 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 There he is. Connection has been made. Yeah, seemingly this My guy does will never actually know some martial arts. So I'll give him that. Yeah. He's a terrible actor. He's weird looking and he's creepy. But he seems to know martial arts. Hey, fellas. Hey, what's up? What's up? <laughs> you guys ain't gonna believe this. This morning, I met this girl named Tina. Body so lean. Face like a queen. Graceful as a ballerina. Is this how you talk to other human beings? Yes. I can't. What the hell do you mean? Ain't no time to be in love when you a big ass stud. You end up a dud, cuz. But I, I never met an angel so intriguing that I first wanted to get into her head before getting her into bed. <laughs> you sound like Oprah Winfrey, my man. Get into our head. I'll give you a break, nigga, please. <laughs> I'll 
sit this I like how he's like noping out of this. Like that's secret. Yeah, this was yes, this was written by an eleven year old. Wake up, my brother. Ain't no time to be in love. Sexy babes are waiting. I'm more than anticipating the girls will be dating. Come on, man. We've seen we've seen that one get some, and we've seen this one, but not 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 filthy. Well, no, he made up with that girl in the alley. No, no, the white one. But he's not filthy. The other one. Well, whatever. I'm gonna go to the bar. Would you like something? I'll take a sip now. Okay. What is this? I don't know. Is she a waitress or a friend? A waitress. Hey, Tina. Okay. Fancy scene. How do you have the same My outfit on? You kidnapped me. Hey, baby. This morning, without a doubt, you were checking me out. So, what about we go out? Yeah. Hey. He was trying to be good. Good job, That's a good observation. I'm out. I guess we are out. Why are you dissing me when you should be kissing me? And why you want to be stuck up, huh? No. I, I want to be smart. See, I'm interested in guys that are interested in my inter as well as my outer. Uh, all you're interested in is my outer. Inter? And all I have is a screw rabbit. Sorry, rabbit. Tricks. I'm a kid. How many bad movies do you think that line is in? Mm. How many movies do you think people have said, sorry, rabbit, tricks are for kids? I don't know. Too many. Thank also, you. like, this is the 90s. Why is he dressed like it's the 80s? Why is everybody dressed like it's the 80s? I don't know. I have a sneaking suspicion that this came out in 1995, but it was filmed in the like 80s. Like 89 or something? No, like 90. 87. Okay. You haven't even given me a chance yet, baby doll. I know what's up. Your body's slamming, your face is jamming. But how do you know that that's all I care about, huh? Because you remind me of my dog, Rover. You even have the same color eyes. <sighs> Now, Got those you untouchable may be a little vibes. more pickier than Rover. See, I saw Rover with the pit bull today. Now, you don't look like the pit bull type to me. I think you're a little too conceited for that. Conceited? Mm-hmm. And I can't believe the girls you get with those phony pickup lines. I get what I get with flattery and bullshit. <laughs> Just kidding. Mm -hmm. I have a funny feeling. If I looked up the word dog in the dictionary, Ray, I see your face. Check you out. Yeah. BDSOH. Beauty, balls, and a sense of humor. What a package. Have I hit the lot or what? Damn, girl. You remind me of me. <laughs> Talk about stuck up. Girl, I want to get you. Mm -hmm. Just like my dog, Ray. Your see, dog wants to fuck you. He does a trick. Yeah. I give him a bone. I bet your bone doesn't care what trick it does, as long as it gets in. Honey, trust me. Yeah, trust me. My days as a rover are over. Love has made me wise. I see chemistry in your eyes. <laughs> Maybe. Well, let's hook up, buttercup. What up? <laughs> Come on, Tina. Why don't you give me a chance to prove that this morning really was chemistry? Yeah, I'm. Um, you. This is. You will not. This is the two things. Didn't know Shane Dawson wrote this. That's hilarious. What? Like, my two reactions to this movie are what? You. Who was that? Um. I guess this is a friend. I think he's a chemistry teacher. <laughs> Maybe this doesn't discount him. This isn't discount Kim Fields, that's discount Zendaya. <laughs> Uh-oh. Here's our villain, Turban Balls, apparently. <laughs> Living in a completely bare-ass apartment with, like, one guitar body hanging on the wall? Just the body, no, no neck. Or is that, like, a clock? It might be a clock. Where the hell you been? Um... <laughs> is there any reason he has an armor station How in his apartment? Do I have to tell you that I don't like you hanging out with that crazy bitch? Hey, just... No, no, no! When are you gonna learn? Listen, now you are my girl, and home is where the heart is. No, sometimes I need time for myself. In our bare ass apartment Tina. where the lights are always fucking Tina, like we are like an a acid hammer scene. and a nail. Baby, we belong together. You know, I don't know anymore, John. I mean... Yes, he's definitely a minimalist. 
was thinking maybe we need to split. Don't you forget who's the hammer. Women, I tell you, sometimes you just need a few smacks to keep your ass in line. Enough! Too many. You're already son of a bitch. You know, I'm through. Okay, what is with the I'm lighting? I don't get the lighting. Come, um, on, come here, you fucking disobedient fuck. <laughs> you know what? You got a mouth on you too big for your face, huh? Why don't you just sit there and keep your mouth shut for once? No! Ooh, baby! No. Ooh. You got some balls on you tonight, huh? Huh? Is that how it's gonna be? Yeah. I mean, Can you. Oh! Yay? Is that? Nope. Now she just showed up at his karate dojo. Go from one to the next to the next. No, I don't, no I, dialogue, no exposition, no I, I, Like, she leaves her boyfriend, two seconds later she's at his dojo, and they're play fighting or whatever. Well, like, the dojo scene, see, what, what probably should have happened was, like, montage. <laughs> the dojo sh scene should have happened before. She goes back. Right. To learn some self-defense. Right. And then she uses that... To get away from her. To get away from him. Her evil white man. Right? Um, and then she, like, maybe packs up and shows up at his dojo. Or shows up at his house, and they, they get busy. I mean, this... Because in, in the universe of this world, who knows where she went that night? The next day she's at the dojo, and then she, so you, you need to get your ass beat, you just had this traumatizing experience, now you fucking this random looking nigga? This motherfucker looks like a ninja turtle, I'm done! <laughs> Lord, he can't even work a zipper. Yeah, I don't zip myself in a much, so this one doesn't have a he don't zip me out of the bear suits. Also, like, we can't have extended makeout sessions standing up because he's so much significantly taller than I am. It, like, will hurt us both. He's bent over. I'm bent up. It's just, hey. Oh, no! Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. None of this. None of this. Oh, this is upsetting. Crying? Is this post coitus yeah, or? I'm so confused. What? <laughs> Speak up. We'll see about that. Many <laughs> <laughs> cry. Yep. Yes, we have reservations. It'll be just a moment, sir. Eyes <laughs> can't focus. Because they have reservations to go to the club? Well, I'm gonna go and powder my nose, you guys. Is that okay? We'll go with you. Who asked permission? Like, I'm going to the bathroom. I'll be back. Sometimes he'd be like, oh, baby, where are you going? I'd be like, that's not your fucking business. It'd be like in the house. And I'd be like, hey, not your business. But you always ask me fucking where I'm going. I do. I always ask him where he's going. Cause... Are you leaving me? <laughs> what? You're leaving me forever. I know you're not. I just like messing with you. Hmm. Oh, you do. Come in for one more of those. One more time. <laughs> mm. 
The first time you tasted like fruit punch, but the second, the subsequent times you didn't. So I was just. <laughs> I just, I love you, is all. No, you're very sweet. Baby, baby. Where are you sprung, man? <laughs> man, we should have gone to Jack in the Box. You sound like the puppet what? in the front door. What this is he wearing? <laughs> I'm a puppet. So what you two plan on? He's doing? still wearing the same outfit. That's a cherry. Cherry. What are any of these people wearing or doing? So I took out this fine Japanese girl. I took out to eat. Where'd you take it? Took it up. Men hung low. <laughs> Hey, what are you, the freaking Is that racist? I, I don't even know what he said. This is, I'm yeah, just, men, men hung low. Yeah, yeah, it was. Yeah. Speaking to the microphone, bro. I got a dip, sir. Right this way, sir. Where are they? I am. Um... They're at the same club they were at earlier. That looks like. Looks like somebody's house. Yeah, this place is pretty hype, ain't it? Looks hey. like a loft apartment. It's the... in like hey, let's go back. Let's, this let's is have a second. Let's go, let's go back. Let's go back. I just want. <laughs> this place. I, I, I want everybody to see. Okay. This fucking place is empty. Yeah. Aside from the dancers. The dancers. Yeah. It looks like a lot of park. Yeah, this place is pretty hype, ain't it? Hype? <laughs> Motherfucker, ain't nobody here! <laughs> it's just that exclusive, baby. That's why it's so hype. Yeah. 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 This is the home dogs hangout, the dragon's lair. When we call drinks in the house! Well, I don't know if they go that far. My credit is still. Uh, I need to get filthy up there to bust some rhymes. Go filthy, go filthy, go filthy. <laughs> if you insist. I really don't. Now they're people. There, there's that guy. Uh. I stuck my girlies on a Friday night. Shoot the pain and candlelight. Music pumping, crowd is jumping. Later on tonight, we feel something. Nice ADR. <laughs> oh shit. So clearly he's actually a rapper. Night swim. And they're just playing his track. On the night swim, baby. Here we go, here we go, here we go, let it flow. I just want to see you dance. Let's go. You know you throw. We don't dare come up for air. The treasures of the moonlight chair. Night swim. I pick you on the night swim. Watch your Here we go, let it flow. Here we go. Don't worry about John. You know this clown? I just broke up with him. He's obviously bitter. Tina. He's also crazy, Ray. Ray, huh? Hey, hey Tina. Tina. Why'd you just admit it? You, you missed me. <laughs> let's get out of here. Come on, you guys. Let's go. Yo, 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 Ray. This here is my girl. And I think it is time that you skip your punk ass out of here alone. Or you're going home with my fist imprinted in your face, b -b boy Check this out, cuz. Yeah. I. Hey man, homeboy's yeah. tripping. What's homeboy been snipping? That's my ex boyfriend causing trouble. Come on, let's go. Oh, is that right? Well, if he wanna be dumb, let him come and get some. Yeah, step off, fool. No, we're gone. Before I have to get thrown in the slammer after throwing down the hammer. Come on, let's go. Let's get out of here. Even at times like this, he's spitting out. Oh, <laughs> what does his shirt say? I don't know, we haven't gotten a good look at the back of his shirt. Also, why'd you beat his ass? But boy. Sorry, guys. Yo, Raven! Oh, wait, wait. I thought I told you to leave alone, and not with my woman. I'm not your woman anymore, John. I told you. <laughs> Some bowling league. Mm -hmm. Maybe I was in a bad mood. I'm sorry. We're through, John. My budget back days like are over. I'm on a 55 year old white man? Why is he in a bowling league? See, John. Real men don't beat up on women. Hey, Ray, it ain't that simple, you see. She left me before. She always comes back. Come on, baby, no more fucking around. No more games. Let's get out of here. I hate you, John. I hate you. Now do you believe me? Maybe I hear what you're saying. 
I know what your heart is saying. It's saying you're a jerk. It's saying you're an abuser. It's saying there is no place in my heart for you, John. No place in my heart for you, but boy. No, man. That stud's got you brainwashed. That stud. Asshole ruined my rap. I was flowing. What's no, you weren't. Great. He did us a favor. Yo, homie, I'm packing, and soon I'll be body stacked. Don't make me shoot that crusty mango out of work. You know what? I'll so step back, Jack. Screw you. Oh, no, thanks. I prefer your mama. Bitch took the bait, taught me more than the porno tape. <laughs> yeah? Come on, don't be an idiot, Moore. You got bullets in that finger? Come on, punk. Make my goddamn day. Come on. Hey, man, it's real, homie. So don't make me kick your butt, peanut. And don't make me end your sex life. Because we all know you're a jerk off. Jerk off. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh, no. My wigger. Come on, man. Come on. I got no ice for Kick all your friends' ass. <laughs> then I'm gonna kick your ass. Oh, is that what you want, big man? Is that what you want? Come on, let's go. Wait, he has friends? Where his friends come from? Come on. I'm confused. Woo! We don't wanna get this dirty. Oh, wait! Random. Oh, who is this man? Random Matt Damon. Who is this man? Why is everyone in this film a discount of somebody else? Fucking. Discount? What's oh, what's his name? What's the Dark Knight's name? Oh, uh, Christian Bale. Discount Christian Bale. Discount fucking great value fucking <laughs> Matt Damon there in the back. Who are those kick people? All your friends' ass. <laughs> they were walking by like the kind of construction that site. There's some dudes hanging around. Were they supposed to be like his posse? Yeah, there you go, Christian Bale. Thank you. I got tearaway pants too! <laughs> Is this supposed to be like a racist gang? Like, I am fucking. Maybe? Kick his ass, right? There's like a. A fat construction worker, there's a Russian hitman here. We had a fucking metalhead. But who is okay, here's a here's a question. Who is this person? I assume he's part of the racist gang. He's white, so and he's not our wig. I don't know what's happening. I don't know who these people are. Oh my god! There's a bunch of toughs hanging outside of a fucking street toughs hanging outside of a construction site. That are now apparently. Oh god, we still have half of this movie to go. Like. Frank, or filthy fucking Phil, whatever the fuck your name is. I guess filthy's a lover and not a fighter. <laughs> this nigga just die right words. there. Last words. <laughs> it's gonna be etched on his tombstone. I need so badly, like. 
I need Alt Shift X to like see this. <laughs> oh Lord! To explain that is so wow. To I need I need some one of those explainer like channels to just see this movie and explain what is happening. There's no explanation, baby. <laughs> I don't know. Like, I thought this was, like, kind of a lighthearted comedy martial arts movie, and now there's, like, straight-up murder going on. Well, you got lucky this time, Ray. Cop saved you. Tomorrow's another day. <laughs> uh, City Dragon, 1995. Also, how did he not get arrested? Uh-oh, hey, don't throw that one church you have too far. Oh, Bruce Lee time. You know how when you're angry over your friend's death, you just break out you break, your nunchucks. You just break out them chucks. Mm -hmm. This is a serious movie about racism. I called the hospital. They wouldn't tell me anything. Well, this is all your fault. Oh. I'm gonna oh, kill your bastard boyfriend. Hey, you're my man now. Don't touch me. <laughs> Oh, nurse, at least you've got a bedside manner. How you doing? Are you okay? Yeah, relieve the pressure. Okay, relieve here the we pressure. go. Here we go. Ah, oh, yeah. thanks. Hey! Hey! hey. Die. Woo. Learning with the so how many nurses have you caught? <laughs> huh, son? Man, don't make me laugh. It only hurts when I laugh. <laughs> oh, this shit ain't funny. His ass is mine. Why are you wearing a oh, woman's, true, like, like, you, with a home like you can wear what you want. And I don't want to be mean or, like, what, what? You're doing great, sweetie. Yeah. <laughs> You're non-binary, and that's, that's all right. Oh, he's toast. Right? The period of that says, I swear, I mean, some people, head, some no things look like a start of a what? porno. Yeah. Mindful. No, don't lose your freedom, man. Oh, don't lose your freedom going after that buster, John. Yeah, I don't give a fuck. Pay back some money. Going after that buster. Okay. <laughs> yeah, fine. Good, good. You guys don't understand. I'll have to live with him after this movie. I mean, this is going to be non-stop from saying stuff from this movie. Yeah, but I boy. thought I was checking out. I had only one regret. And you finally found love, Ray, man. Don't lose it, man. Don't do anything stupid. Well, enough of this sentimental shit. Get well, brother. We got skirts to hit. I think with all this rhyming down in my soul, I'm gonna concentrate on a record gold. Gentlemen, excuse me, I've got to take his temperature. Ooh, his thermometer's rising! Okay, let's go look for John. I'm just gonna... Pick a little popcorn bits out of the bowl. Oh, hey. I fell asleep. I'm going. No, no, no. no I'm, just, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <coughs> Can I watch? Don't you knock, Num Nut? What are you wearing? Oh, I love you too, Tina. Why do you have a burlap poncho? <laughs> Always taking off his shirt, baby. That's what he does. Yeah, that's what he does. <laughs> yeah, three weight lifts so, were great. We're just being in love. Oh, that's cool. It's boring, man. It's Ten o'clock, you snoring. So, man, you catch up with that John bastard yet? No. He's keeping his distance. That's cool. So, how are you and Cherry doing? Oh, oh man, I had to dump her. And she was stuck to me like glue. What could I do? She want to marry them baby in a carriage. I hit the door. I can't take no more. <laughs> you are cold, man. So what you up to now? Yeah. Oh, man, I got a new scheme. I call it the phony run my ass over scheme. Check it out. You'll love it. All right. Now, we pick up a two lovely ladies coming out of the car, right? And I act all stupid and straw in front of the car, right? And get hit and boom, drop like a rock. Then I act all messed up and delirious and shit like... <laughs> I, 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 and you play the doctor who happens to noises. be on the scene. You try to revive me. Come on, Rick, try to revive me. <laughs> 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 nah, no. 
Oh, 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 oh. Man, I, I was liking that. We was we was doing something. Yeah. I'm discovering that really is the female gaze. I'm discovering things I didn't know about myself. Mm-hmm. Always go for That's that. That's fine. That, I've been hurt shit that having compassion in that that guilt trip, man. <laughs> Women are always weak to that guilt trip. It's like poison. Put some in a trance so we can get in their pants. Boop, yeah. Okay, but here's here's how this works, right? Yeah. If you have oh, a right. girlfriend, I these out of commission. you can have regular sex with her. Like the old days, the biggest dogs in the universe, man. Come on. You know, Tina stuff should be getting That's, old by now. Anyway, that makes you know sense, right? <laughs> no, Ben Drew waits us, my buddy. Don't be a buddy, Duddy. We could go and play the field after we put on our shield. <laughs> but, oh, condom, oh, condom. I love you so much for protecting my stuff and keeping me alive today for one more row in the. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> hey. Okay. Um. But if you have a girlfriend, you don't. She gets on birth control, and you know that she's clean. You could just continue to have sex with with them. But her stuff gets old. Are you? Are you trying to say something? I'm saying what he said. Okay. I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna... <laughs> what do you say? I can't. I'm in love, Frick. Deputy Dog has put down his crown and will no longer be around. Oh, man, are yeah. you sure? I'm not it doesn't exist. Tight body could tempt you to be not. I'm sure. So get on, you big dog. You're solo now. I put down my cape for good. No more sex in the hood. I would if I could, but I choose love over sex, I guess. All right, Ray. Okay. If those salivating urges arrive, we'll team up one last time. Also, like, this is one of the first time, not one of the first time, but certainly, like, it's, it's refreshing that they're like very happy about condom use in this movie. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So I, I guess score. These male hoes love fucking condoms, so they don't get bitches pregnant. They don't get AIDS. Who this? Where this? That's a question. I'm pregnant, Papa. Papa, don't preach. What? What? You thirty I'm years old. No, Tina. Yes, Papa. Tell I can't lies, believe Tina. I'm working two jobs just to get you through college. What did you do? No, I could never do anything right in your eyes. Don't, Don't give me that sob sister stuff. That sob sister stuff? What? What does that even mean? You screwed me as an embryo, now you want to screw me as an adult. What do you mean, I screwed you as an embryo? I got your mama pregnant my last year in pre-med school. Your grandpa was paying my medical tuition. But he took all that away as soon as he found your mother was pregnant. My dream of being a doctor was gone. And you blame me all these years? I break my back, I lose my dream, and what do I get? Another mouth to feed. Screw you, Papa. I'm gonna have my baby, and I'm not gonna blame him for my life. This movie you are aborting. over the place. No! Hell no! Don't make me kick you out of my house, Tina. My baby, and I'm not gonna blame him for my life. You are aborting. <laughs> you are aborting. <laughs> I, this, this is so much. It's so mi- What? <coughs> is this movie a comedy? Is it like a serious martial arts drama? Is it a critique on, on 
women's reproductive rights and racism. Like, this is all over the place. Like, I don't... Is it a music video? Is it a porno? Like... <laughs> like what you go from one scene to the next and it's like wacky slapstick comedy fucking and then it's like random rap scenes but then it, but then the next thing you know it's fucking like some guy a getting com- shivved in an alley right and it's a, but then it's a commentary on like domestic violence it, it, yeah domestic violence fucking abortion fucking street Street life? Street toughs? Uh, no! Sex in the hood? Hell no! Don't make me kick you out of my house, Tina. You would, would you? You are getting an abortion. Screw you, Papa! Get your things. Get your butt out of my house now. No problem. I'm moving in with Ray. your martial arts pad. Sitting around reading magazines. Tina. Hi. You know, I this is a pad. No, no, no. Come on. Come on. Come on. Sit down. What's going on? That drunk dude, did, did, did he, he hurt you? No, Ray. No. Things have been going so smooth. So smooth? I don't want to rock the boat. Yeah, you're, I don't want to rock the your boat Your ex-boyfriend either. stabbed your friend's friend. <laughs> I'm pregnant, Ray. Don't try gays, kids! Yeah. Papa kicked me out because I'm pregnant, Ray. And it's not a baby, but he doesn't know. There's only one thing to do. A karate punch. Marry you. Abort that demon scene. Cupid put a dart through my heart. Will you marry me, sweetheart? Let's get married for the baby! I... I don't understand this. Some people like artichokes, but I like cucumbers because they, they don't give you all that chafing and get back here. Oh! Yeah, we Mary, you want to shut up on the phone here? Go, go back. <laughs> Some people like artichokes, but I like cucumbers because they, they don't give you all that chafing and get back here. Oh! Yeah, we Mary, you want to shut up on the phone here? Yeah, why don't you they shut got up? a cucumber up his ass? Come here! All right. Stand by your mask. You met my ass now. Okay, shut up, all right? Oh, this film is just going everywhere. Yikes. Yeah, my heart. Oh, hello, Crowley9. Yeah, what is it? What's up, darling? So Tina's gonna go through with this? She, she's gonna marry that curly-haired freak? <laughs> that curly-haired freak? <laughs> what kind of human has curly hair? <laughs> Nine seven six what? I don't I don't know. What I do know is that you can't break them old phones. Nah. Say the fucking cell phone, dude. Mm-mm. Curse those blacks and Jews and Irish for their curly hair. <laughs> hey, 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 hey! Watch that phone, you dumbass! You're gonna break it! You're always on that damn phone! He's probably dialing nine seven six hunk. What the hell's going on here? Look at this mess, man! Know. Start cleaning it up! Five minutes, man. Just can't you give me one lousy minute? Fuck your minute, John. Just get it going. Clean up. Move it, man. Put it to work. <laughs> what is he, like a dishwasher? <laughs> Get it 
dishwasher. I, a prep cook, maybe? You don't want to move, boy? You don't want to move? Then get the hell out of here, John. You're fired. Move it out, buddy. <laughs> I, I don't know. The head waiter can't fire me. How about that? The host. <laughs> the maitre d'. <laughs> oh, yeah. I'm fired. You're going to fire me, huh? Really? Yep, John. You're fired. I'm flaming and you're fired. <laughs> I... I want to... I'm going to write a letter to Glad about this movie. Because this is... This Care is, of Peacock Films. This is discrimination of the highest order. Yeah, you know, he just ran the eggs out in the kitchen. Hey, fire jump, get the fuck out of my kitchen! <laughs> it's really fucking funny. It's really fucking funny. You know why it's so funny? Because I couldn't possibly be fine. My dead man... <laughs> of the court that the defendant John Haran Where is this judge from? Random Australian judge was flown in to fucking do the sentencing. <laughs> what the fuck is happening? Be reprimanded to the state mental institution for a minimum of 25 years for the murders of Sam Edwards, Carlos Rivera, and Mary Smith, alias Queen Mary. Take him away. Okay, so he killed those three people. Yes. Now the the gay guy, Queen Mary, makes sense, I guess, because uh, he drowned him. The, the The other two guys, like the manager, he just punched, <clears throat> mm -hmm. and like the the dishwasher or whatever, he just like he had a knife and he like slapped it away and like pushed him. Yeah, but he's dead. How'd they all die? <laughs> This movie Pop is... it down, freaks! <laughs> I'm in trouble deep! This movie keeps getting weirder and weirder. Like... Well, I... well, and now, we're in 45 minutes. We still have a while to go before the movie's over. What's the climax? I don't know. Is he gonna escape? Hey. There we go. Hey, John. Sit nice and still for me. Oh. Maybe this is happening in his head. Yeah. <coughs> very good, very good. I that's a possibility. Sweet dreams. Knee shots. <laughs> <laughs> Montage. Every single 
Central Park have exactly the same place at the 90s? Like, I vaguely feel like I've come across this movie before, which says something about the kind of stuff I watch. Yeah, I mean, we yeah, ran into that recently yeah. where we were like, have we seen this crappy post apocalyptic movie before? Yeah, we didn't. Yeah. Oh, is he getting pegged? Yeah. I just want to be sick. Hey, man! Those, uh, those, those fucking park weddings are cheap. Okay, tell me. What's so important you dragged me from work? I got a surprise for you. Yes. Okay, um, roses. No. No, this is LA. Jewelry? Maybe it's not. No. Um, a trip to Cancun. No. Tell me! I wrote a song from my heart. About how you make me feel. Oh my god, oh my okay. god okay. really? Do it, do it. Look, look up in the sky. Who do I see with the brown pretty eyes? Tina, Tina, a lovely ass can be no such a fly attitude that I really had to meet her. I saw you in the park, kind of sad and adoring. I knew when I saw you that our match would not be boring. Love, yes, I love my sweet, lovely Tina. No, we're on. I am your wife now. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Let's not, let's not do this. No, no, let's not. Earth that I would rather be now. Not even a her joint bank full account. of life is the way you make me feel. Her. Charm and nope, good looks, my sweet, I mean, lovely I guess Tina. A song. Bimble champs and sluts, my life it had no meaning until that day in the park. When I met my African queen, I love you more than anything, Tina. She's about to die. Has she had her baby yet? Like, I have no, no. idea how much time has passed. I've got a serious craving for an empty fridge. Pickles? No? Well, what do you want, my sweet? Sweet. That's it. Ice cream. Out of a uh, liquor store? What you got? I'm kick your ass. Ooh, a dollar ninety eighty five a pack. Where is this? I got that Chamana, man. Come on, man. Does he just get into situations with street toughs everywhere he goes? Yeah. Like this guy in Taco Face again? Yeah, I think this is the same gang. Maybe. That's your ice cream right there? Oh, what? Wait, what? You think about your ice cream? <laughs> now what, punk? Yeah. Now what? Yeah, this is definitely written by white. Well, I don't know though, because Filthy Frank is heavily involved in the Filthy Phil. But he might be one of the whitest black men in the ever lived. I got these nunchucks. The fat guy from Lost. Nice strip mall, guys. Yeah. You need to jack him up. that guy is so white. Yeah. Stop pretending he's a fucking vato. California, they were like eight, eight fifty. So cheaper than out here, though. What was the point of this scene? There was no point. Scratchers. <laughs> it's been gone so long. You must have gotten into another fight with street tubs. I'll just lay here and show off my side hey, boots. Where's the ice cream? Oh, I'm sorry, babe. I accidentally dropped them on the way. <laughs> if you want me to go back, I'll... No, no, no. You ain't going nowhere. But I'll be right back. Yeah, the point of the I scene is I thought you wanted a snack. I did. And you're it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Well, first of all, 
whipped cream is gross when you get it on you. Like, you gonna fuck? You all sticky and shit? Like, I'm cool. I said I know I'm grown. Hello. Is he applying for an I'm office Mrs. job Jones, now? but you can call me Renee. I'm your new boss. It's a pleasure to meet you. Oh, he, Pleasure's all he mine. always had a job? Uh, Mr. Goldstein said that uh, you personally requested no, uh, apparently she's to got assist the you, but, but uh, I've never met you. True, but I've had my eye on you for... Oh, wow! <laughs> and I can tell your performance will be outstanding. <laughs> okay, here's a budget you requested. I think I think they can still I have five thousand dollars off each month. Excellent. But I guess he always Ron had an office and job. Such good work calls for a celebration. <sighs> if this was a porn. I mean, I feel like just the guys that wrote it watched a lot of porn. And we're like, what if we made a a kind of porn martial arts <laughs> acid trip movie? When did he get an office job? Like, why doesn't he just own the dojo? Yeah. I don't know. I'm so confused. My brain hurts. You know those wine glasses I keep in my office? I'm gonna break up the crystal. Scotch? Drambuie? What is this? <sighs> Fucking prune juice she keeps in there. It's a warrior's drink. <laughs> that might be port. I feel like that's port. The stress of this project has made me tense. Would you mind? What? What? A massage. Uh, Indulge my executive privilege. Well, it's domestic <clears throat> violence, racism, sexual harassment. I suppose I you'll be okay. But for the record, we're married men. Okay. Why is he wearing this oversized jacket? Why is he wearing his dad's jacket? I don't want to be the middle woman. I just want you for sex. Slide trombone. What? Renee gets. I love my wife. She's expecting. I love my curvy well, wife. Well, then I'm sure you'll want to provide for your family. You know he's wearing the a. Economy's a bitch, and so am I. Layoffs every day. I gotta go. Ray, we can't build a relationship based on rejection. We all have deadlines. I'm, I'm afraid, afraid by tomorrow, tomorrow it's put out or get out. I might want to call Sweet HR. Dreams. <laughs> She's the Harvey Weinstein of this movie. <laughs> okay, so I guess this really happened. Why is he in ballerina shoes? Also, like, this is a doctor's office. Yes. This pain, is not right? this is not an insane asylum cell. He's in he's in the fucking doctor's office. Where you go for your check. <laughs> Funny form. <laughs> With cheese and flowers and chirping birds who laugh and scream and Funny freaking Yeah, they're coming to take me away, haha. -ha. Just remember, Ray. Life may seem a bowl of cherries. They're probably in a random Planned Parenthood. But payback's a motherfucking bitch. Yeah, or some low income clinic. Yeah. Like one of their uncles fucking runs a general practice and they're like, hey, can we use your office for, for a scene?
That's uh. not how stray jackets work, bro. Affairs. Yes, just a minute. Ray, it's for you. Who is it? It's your wife. Yeah, Tina. Yeah, Tina. I, I know it's late, Tina. Eleven o'clock. Yeah, Tina. I think I remember how to tell time, Tina. Listen, I know we haven't been spending any time with each other lately, but I'm swamped with work here. So did he put out? Is that is that the inference that we're getting? <laughs> HR is gone. Mm, it's kind of what I was expecting. Well, it, like... I have never thought once in my entire relationship with him, of him, you know, you can fuck it, and you work, at, you, work, you work in a restaurant, you're going to be coming home at like 1 o'clock, 2 o'clock in the morning. I never think like, oh, he's he's got to be doing something. If I, I've never called, I like, if it was super late, if it was like an hour past the time it was due, I'd call. Or I'd like text and be like, oh, are you okay? But, but other than that, like, mm, that's a lot. Like, I'm probably more likely to do that just because I'm a worrier. I worry when you're not here. He does. He will, like, I was, I was like 10, like 15 minutes late to work. Uh, maybe like, I was more like 20 minutes late to work, work once. And he was like, he texts me and I was like, oh my god, I'm I'm fine. He is a worry wart. I don't think you're cheating on me, I just I get worried. He does, he gets worried because I'm a tiny little person. Um I appreciate oop, I appreciate that. I'm not gonna bother to pick that up. I'm just gonna grab a different lighter. I'm reminded a bit from a stand-up comedian. I asked my wife's OBGYN how long it would be fine to have sex with her when she is pregnant. He said, not after the water is broken. What bothers me is someone must have tried it before before for him to say that. Mm. <clears throat> yeah. The budget's due in the morning, Tina. Screw my job. You don't want to screw my job or have a kiss your ass. Make up your freaking mind already, okay? I'll be home as soon as I can, okay? Bye. What are these sound effects? Screw your job. Is she, is she tossing playing cards? Yeah, looks like it. Have you seen my socks? I can't find them anywhere. Should be in your drawer. See, Tina, no socks. Did you mix them up again in your underwear drawer? Yeah, I think they're in my drawer. Sorry. Man, Tina. This is a healthy relationship. Can you please stop leaving your lady shavers in the bathtub before I lose a freaking toe, all right? Hey. Stop leaving your lady shavers in the bathroom. <laughs> before I lose a toe on this plastic disposable razor. <laughs> God. <laughs> the worst. All right. Fix my socks up with your lady things again. <laughs> I have to look at the drawer right next to this drawer? How could you? Forget about that. Are you going to be home at 11 o'clock again tonight? Yeah, I've got a lot of work to do. You know, um, that's all you care about is that stupid job. And it's not good for me or the baby. Sorry, I, I can't help. Now, Tina, no offense, but one go. of us got to work. Mm. I can't... Again, this is this is a MGTOW movie. Likely, like, again... I don't, this is a lot. I'm just tired. Give me a kiss. Yeah, I'll see you tonight, all right? Oh, um, don't forget to tell your job to kiss my ass. Don't forget to tell awesome. your job to kiss my ass. Look at 
can't wait to go back to work and say that. He <laughs> have to go his own way at the end of this. How dare you get money for the baby? No, I doubt he's going to go his own way, sadly. I can't wait for you to like, I can't wait for like, me to be able to tell you like, tell your job to kiss my ass. It's your job too. Doesn't work. It does work because you do a different job than I do at the same place. So not always tell your job to kiss my ass. Sometimes we do the same job. When? When have we ever done the same job? When we're both serving. When are we both serving? It's happened. It happened once. More than once. No, don't touch the bear. But you're okay. I can touch you. Yeah. <laughs> How dare you to put food on our table? How dare you fuck your generic white lady boss? Also, I kind of feel like she's just the blonde that he fucked earlier in a different outfit. This movie is so off the rails and all over the place, like, it was a martial arts movie, now it's like a family drama, family work drama thing. <laughs> what was that zoom? <laughs> Do we need the fried chicken leg eating shot? Oh, they put a pile of clothes underneath her fucking her belly. Look, look. Okay, look. Okay. You know, watch, watch how it just bends in the moment. <laughs> the chicken is a lie! Computer, but Jesus. He's all sexed out. What's it gonna be, my brother? Fifteen by one? Oh. Oh. Fifteen by fifteen. Short. Stop being a dick. We've been playing this game too many years for you go stupid on this. Man. All right, my brother. Let's get it on. Uh, Hey man, I'm not white. Come on, wake up. Repeat after me. I, I am, am proud. proud. Two, two, beat, beat, uh, uh. Cracker. Cracker. Come on, man, it's the 90s, right? Anything's possible. You heard those people called Oreo cookies? Black on the outside, white on the inside? All right, all right, all right. You're an Ori glow. <laughs> you glow in the dark, mother? <laughs> Casper the horny ghost? Hey, I must admit, I do believe in spooks. I do believe in <laughs> This is all going to be a yikes for me, fam. <coughs> probably. Pro probably. We got, what, half an hour, 20 minutes left? You're a freaking nut, man. Hey, hey. What happened to Filthy? Right? Still in the hospital? Wow. <laughs> yeah, he did. Rough. He died. You keep a secret. Oh, shit. You been creeping while your wife's been sleeping! Oh, not exactly. <laughs> What's that mean, man? Either you doing the do or you're not. <laughs> man, Rick, you're my best friend. I can trust you. Yeah, we're, we're each other, man. You're my boss, Mrs. Jones. Yeah? When I go to work, I really have to go to work. You know what I mean? Ooh. If I don't, I'm out. <sighs> Damn, that's scandalous, brother! Come on, can you, can you stop screwing around for once? I need some advice, man. Hey, man, I can't tell you nothing. You the man. You got your cake, you need it too. Aha, uh -huh, real funny, man. Man, what's your freaking problem? I think this inspires you. I'm burning my candle at both ends. My wick is all used up. This double time is killing me. Damn. My wick is all used up. Mm. Who this? Cousin Vicky? Guess who? Cherry? Is that you? 
Yes, it's me, Elle, the movie star. Famous blood in the family. What a talented bunch we are. <laughs> so, what's up, stranger? Well, you know, I'm going to be in town, L.A. for some, I don't know, promo autograph signing something this weekend, and I thought maybe you'd want to hang out with your little cousin? Some more money? No, I'm just kidding. Yeah, right. Well, um, I'm going to be in L.A. Friday, and I'll be at your place around 8. Is that okay? Okay. Bye, Sherry. Discount Rosario night. Dawson. I had to work hey. extra late last night. Mm -hmm. You were asleep. Had a great idea. How about I don't we go away for, I don't know what that was. for the weekend only? You know, just the two of us like we used to. Honey, I can't. My boss wants me to spend this weekend finishing the taxes. You know, those are just excuses. We need counseling. I've been telling you that for six months. Hey, we don't need to waste our time and money on a nosy-ass shrink to hear all about our business, Tina. Mm -hmm. I gotta go. Of course. Give me a kiss. Are yeah, you gonna give me a kiss or what? Screw you. What? Hey, you better hurry up. You're gonna miss your morning office ritual. You know, the morning cup of coffee. The morning, kiss Mr. Goldstein's fat cottage cheese looking ass. You, you don't appreciate sick. shit, do you? <laughs> Here I am, kicking butt at work. I'm trying to make a living for hey, us. Hey, look, you sorry bastard. If you're looking for pity, you've come to the wrong door. Hey, pity, no, Tina, that's the wrong word. The word I'm looking for is understanding. A word that's not a part of your goddamn vocabulary. Understanding? What about ignored or neglected? Do those ring a frickin' bell with you? Oh. Tell your job to kiss my ass. Get up and nowhere to go. <laughs> yeah, I just I do that. I just walk around the house feeling my belly. I ain't got a baby in it. Just like feeling it. Or mine. I love his belly so much. She won't let me at it though. Just a little bit of this. Hey, Vic. This is T. He's gonna... Um, <laughs> I've got a problem. Can you come over quick? Please. Uh, I'll talk to you later. Bye. Come here. I'm surprised it lasted this long. Selfish. Yeah, she's gonna cheat on him with her. Mm -hmm. You know, he works all week. He comes late every night. And when he is here, <laughs> he basically ignores me. Vic, I mean, he, he doesn't sleeps. even touch me anymore. Typical. Man of pigs. I, now, I didn't say he was playing on me. Once a dog, always a dog. You don't know that. It's only obvious. Look who you're talking to, T. I am the queen of being used. Men will be with you until they're sick of you. You're sick of me yet? As soon as Filthy got his record deal. Need I say more? <laughs> Ray wouldn't cheat on me. Oh, no. Well, then what's his problem? No, Filthy got a record deal, apparently. T, come on. How did that happen? From where? Oh, the well, big dog stop cold turkey. You must be doing something right. Aww. He's like footying me with his little slipper. He's so Whatever cool. it is, it's gone now. Mm -hmm. get a little I that. remember when we used to look deep into each other's eyes and he'd hey. say stuff like when Webster put the word hey. gorgeous in the dictionary. Hey, what? hey, hey, I want some, I need this. I don't you. He'd say that. Uh, nothing yet. Nothing yet. <laughs> I'm addicted to his kisses. They wipes them off. Thing to do. Mm. Go, Go get, get your, your man, man girlfriend. girlfriend. Wig towel. Yep, we're going wig towel. 
Go get your man, Excuse girlfriend. Excuse me? I need to talk to Ray. Uh, is he expecting you? No, but... You must be Tina. Yeah. Well, he went out for a while to run an errand. I'm not sure when he's coming back. Okay, I'll just wait. To be honest with you, you couldn't have picked a worse time. You could leave a message or something. That's okay. I'll wait. All right. Suit yourself. What are you looking at, honey? <sighs> Nothing. Honestly. Nothing at all. Damn, white girl. That was a lot. That's a lot of shade. Mr. Mr. Goldstein is uh, really a slave driver, huh? I'm sorry, you're mistaken. I'm Ray's boss. <laughs> Excuse me? I thought Mr. Goldstein was Ray's boss. He was, but Ray showed such potential, I thought the promotion was in order. Oh, really? Ray's been very handy around here. And what do you mean by that? You don't get it. I do. Oh, working late, huh? I told you you couldn't have picked a worse time. Tina, it's not the way it seems. Oh, really? How is it, huh? I wear my fucking gym hey, shorts to work! Mother, you son of a bitch! It's a shame Ray works his ass off, literally, to provide for you and your family, and this is the thanks he gets? There's enough of him to go around. Yeah, that's right. No, I'm not sharing him with you, you bitch. You and your Malibu Barbie, I hope you're very happy. Fuck you very much. Wait, wait, Tina. I did it for us! Don't me! Let this is somebody's house. Ray. Yeah, this is definitely somebody's house. No. I, I got, got a better idea. idea. I'm, I'm letting you go. go. I quit! I don't know if white women ruin everything, but they ruin a lot of stuff. Yeah. Yo, yo, Ray, Ray. They ruin everything you remember, Jerry? you remember her at the dumper, right? Well, she's a big star now, man. Rich as hell, too. Yeah. Hey, she's gonna be at this video store tonight signing autograph posters. I'm gonna go over there and hypnotize her like in the past and be rich at last, my brother. I agree with See you later. Time Probably. To data. Probably. <laughs> oh, this is some autograph thing. Baby, lovely lady. Yeah, is this like the video store Rick, for clerks? What are you doing here? Oh, I heard you were in town, so I rushed on down. What is he wearing? Why is he wearing that bowler hat? What is she wearing? What is he wearing? They got Hellraiser on the shelf over there. I mean, the Jackson 5 said it best. I want what you is back. discount Zidane wearing? You lying, phony agent scumball. Don't you think you've heard her enough? I apologize, Cherry. Okay, Rick. I'll give you another chance. But only one. Thank you, Cherry. Oh, but I'm busy now. But hey. Oh, hey, Star Wars. Oh, and Highlander. They got you some good movies. Pier, don't you? Dark Man. Ooh, yes. Bad but but naked, naked Friday, Friday night. night. Making, making love is a pier. Okay, well, I'll meet you there tonight around midnight, okay? What is this yeah, like blonde bombshell fake Marilyn Monroe Tina. she's putting on? I just I talk like a Tina. baby. I thought it was a little girl voice. I don't know. I'm confused. Woo! It's hit the lot of a sex machine with a lot of green. Cherry. Ooh. Even the ducks Cherry. are like calm down, bro. Baby. Let's get it on. Woo! Wait, honey. Like in the past, you take your clothes off. Oh, is that I can't right? wait to get all sexed up after I see what I've been missing. Baby, you just give me a second. Yes. Oh, Honey, yes. 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 drop those boxers now. Oh, oh Jerry, you can't keep it. Cut the ground, like Rick. Cut the ground. I can't. Cut the ground. Cut the ground. Are we going to see it? Agent, but 
you took advantage of my naivete. You gave me the anger I needed to get to the top as an actress. I'm not a joke anymore, am I, Rick? Oh, no, you're good, Cherry. You can act. Damn, I came here for sex and you make me a mess. Dance with the ducks, Daffy. You're crazy. What? Okay, okay. okay. Get in the water, get in the water, get in the water. What is that? Say that. Dance is like a duck, Daffy. Quack a little louder. <laughs> How are you fucked? No one knows who you are, dude. Wiggle that ass, you! Dance! Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle! Like, where are they gonna post these pictures? Ooh, in the round town. at the drop of a dime. <laughs> it's like, oh, you dropped my soda? Time to beat your ass! <laughs> like, everybody in this world is, like, roided up. Like, it's I got that roid rage. Like, they are ready to take off on you for no ass. Like, you owe me a dollar. Motherfucker, you ain't got another dollar for a soda? Like, get the fuck out of here. Also, who cares? <laughs> You are fighting this battle over your dollar service. Next time, get a shaft, a bitch! <laughs> Save money, get a Dr. Thunder. So for six months he's been trying to get out of the straight jacket. Hey, doctor. Doctor, I got, I got, I got, I got spiders. I got, I see, got spiders in my head. I got I see spiders all over, doctor. Spiders? Spiders? This fool is crazy. Is the doctor lounging <laughs> on a bed next to him? Yeah, he's not a very supportive <laughs> doctor either. No. No, he's got a very... uh, I wish this guy could have been John Hinckley's doctor. To a very bad bedside manner. <laughs> Or actually, Boo, you shot the president? How come you didn't put a boo in his head? <laughs> you fucking failure. <laughs> fucking crazy white man. <laughs> Too many drugs, Spider Man. Gotta cut that shit out. Doc, I'm sure. <laughs> what drug? He's in an asylum. Any drugs he's on, you gave him. <laughs> gotta, gotta cut out all the drugs we give you. Spider. Help me. Also, I don't think he was on help. any drugs. He was just an asshole. Yeah, I like to help. Help string your ass up to the highest tree. <laughs> what is this, doctor? <laughs> wow. Holy shit. Jesus Christ. Oh, my God. What is this, my We're dude? lynching white people now. <laughs> Crazy black old cracker. <laughs> you need Jesus. <laughs> Lucky for you, I've got to ease my conscience and satisfy my Hippocratic oath. Y'all motherfuckers need Let Jesus. Order a brain scan, x-rays, and MRI. Let's see, the nearest MRI. 
Okay, here it is. Oakwood Community Hospital. Damn, but that's five miles away. Damn, state cutbacks. I'll arrange a police escort for Mr. Spider here. <laughs> I, I'm going to be honest. Uh -huh. If my dad were a doctor in an insane asylum, this is the guy he'd be. Yeah, I can see that. Oh, you stupid cracker. I don't want to have to go five miles. I, mm, you ain't shit. Damn, cut back. <laughs> and then send this psycho nut back to his padded cell. Sweet home. Um, that was the greatest scene Just in the to say I got to go. I'm taking Captain Dreadhead to the airport here. Right, right. Why does he have an eye patch? Did he lose an eye? I'm off to Hot Atlanta to record my album on Rawbone Records. Huh? Hey, good luck, man. Hey, yo, uh, Filthy, why don't you wait for me in the car, man? Right. So, <laughs> Tina's still mad at you, huh? Yeah. I miss her, Rick. And she's the only one. She's wearing like one of those Steven hey, Seagal listen, deals. Mm, Forget that cold bitch. It's time to move on, my buddy. Me, jalapeno Helen, with the big ripe melons. Hi, Ray. Who's Rick this? tells me you're a big shot movie producer. Right, right. And um, Ray, you know I do any, I mean anything for a part. Your place or mine. Oh, go Helen, go Helen! It's your birthday! It's your birthday! Uh, excuse me, Senorita. Hey, hey, what's up, Doc? Come here. Listen, Wigger, get this through your Casper Black ass. My dog days are over. I'm married now. I regret what I've done, and I want my family back. I, I don't know of it. I don't know how any of this happened. With the chili pepper melons, get out of my goddamn face. Hey, yo, man, chill out, all right, Curly Fry? And I'll check you later, cuz. Come on, baby. Yes, yeah, she's just in her underwear under a trench coat. Yeah. Hey, there he goes! Is he the one? Is that Ray? <laughs> I don't know what Casper Black Ass means. Oh, wait. Oh. Right, we're going to go back. Okay. Here we go. Here we go, baby boy. All right. We're going to pause it right when we get on. Hey, there there he goes. Is he okay. the one? Is that Ray? Okay, so <laughs> clearly Canadian hockey fan on the right there. He even had the accent. Uh, we got... Why is there a Medford nigga running this crew <laughs> is my question. Is that the middle guy? Yeah. Yeah, I can see that. And then we've got... Um, then we got fucking... What are those pants called? Zubas. Yeah. Uh, uh, Reebok wearing ass. With his, with his fucking... Uh, S fucking... What are those things called? The, the tongues? No. The, the, the high tops? Well, the, 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 the middle part like that sticks out like that. I don't know. I forget what that part of the shoe is called. But. He clearly couldn't afford the pump ups. Let's just say that. Oh God! Look at these guys and like two mullets and a buzz cut. Like one mullet's got a mustache. The ho I mean, clearly the hockey fans got the mustache, the mullet, the feathered mullet. It's looking great. Like good for him. And then are his pants cinched at the bottom there? <laughs> Yeah. Like, I'm not, I don't know what's going on with these guys. I, I need to know why this nigga is in skinny jeans, though. Yeah. I desperate, like, because they are just hugging that crotch. Yeah. There's, and yeah, I guess it is the tongue. You got tongues, tongues out. Yeah, this movie's going to just deserve an award. I don't know what kind, <laughs> but an award. Yep. Because this shit is cray, like. Him. A Razzie, is that I guess. a cooking one? <laughs> what a joke. Come on, guys. <laughs> what? Hey, punk. I'm John's brother, Jack. You know? The one you stole his girl from. Remember? So you're not angry about the fact that your brother is in a mental asylum. And that, you know, you dr he drove your brother to madness. No, no, no. 
stole his girl. Yeah. That's a lot. I didn't steal Jack. Jack. Get up! Listen, you caught me at the wrong time. I'd better leave before somebody gets hurt. Did <laughs> they just clear out, like, did they just clear out a comic book Bruce store Lee. in Milwaukee to find these guys? Nitwit. Street photography, starving stuntman. It's a fake, it's like you. What? Hey, 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 hey! Are you hard of hearing? Bruce like Schwarzenegger, pretend the man? Clearly, <laughs> they just grabbed a method off the street, so they want to make ten bucks! <sighs> Is that Jay from Jay and Silent Bob before Bruce, he got banned? Bruce, we was a pussy, just like you, your father, your forefathers, fathers, forefathers, and our four. <laughs> Matter of fact, if Bruce or we was alive today, he'd be sucking my big schlong like a big old lollipop. <laughs> hey, I need <laughs> Surround him. Into the gym lately. Not meant for nigga. He's he's got that pizza buffness. <laughs> this is a big fight. I mean, clearly, there'll be some kind of final showdown. But this is the big fight scene. Zumba's just standing over there in the back watching. They all have like comic book shirts on. Clearly cleaned out a comic book store. Hey, hey, I'm sorry. Uh oh. Drawers are coming out. Here comes Zumba's. Zumba's is apparently the best fighter of the bunch. I told you you were a wimp. Oh, that, that's the brother. This okay. is for my brother, you little shit. Oh, oh, the oh, oh, oh. No honor in that. This is for my brother, you wimp, after he kicked like 10 guys' ass in front of you. This is for you, Bruce. You're still the king of Kung Fu. This is for you, Bruce. You're still the king of kung fu. And then, of course, we had to play... Racist music. You're still the king of kung fu. <sighs> trying times. We live in y'all trying times. <laughs> this movie's amazing. <laughs> Tina. I'm so glad we found it. Yeah. Tina. We will not be doing taking a bath together. It's gross. I love you. And I, I'd shower with you. Maybe hey, yeah, we like. Oh, this ain't no joke. Big tubs or whatever. Keep hope alive. What up? I'm no good without her. Emotion to your confusion. When the shit hits the fan, you need a master plan. This is what we do. Any day now. You know, somehow I pictured this day to be much different. This is the psycho's baby, right? I don't know who baby this is. I think that's what we established earlier. She said it was a John's baby. God spelled backwards is dog, and men are fleas on the dog's back. Change the subject. Okay. Put your music on. Yo, this is Filthy Phil and the Shipwreck Crew coming straight to you on National Top 40 Ounce. I didn't say 40 Ounce of G. Well, never mind all that. This next song was sent to me by my homie Ray as a very special shout out to his baby, Tina. It's called Chemistry. Chemistry. I, I don't I I'm I'm not sure how late term uh, second trimester I'm not sure. I see the chemistry of man the trimester in your eyes. <laughs> and man so backwards is now therefore. <laughs> we finally found the mix of formulas correct. Yeah. So I got to pay my price and give our love respect. Girl, I did you wrong. I don't blame you for leaving. But let
let me make it up to you for give me an even, even. Give me one more try to put the twinkle back into your ebony eyes. Talking about chemistry, baby, just you and me, yeah. Talking about chemistry. I mean, that's just my song at the beginning, but whatever. It's gonna be our wedding song. <laughs> that's the ghost that you've ever said to me. <laughs> Team was wrong. Oh no. Oh no, these clothes are gonna come out of my belly! <laughs> I am. Relax. Really like you. Oh, that's your reaction. Oh shit, is it gonna be at the same hospital that he's getting the MRI at? Oh lord. You know, that guy looks familiar. I don't regret what I did, Doc. There's only so much crap a man can take, right? Sure. I heard my Tino was gonna marry that dipstick right. I just lost it, you know. I mean, I'm just cracked, you know what I mean. Not you cure. No, I don't ever remember doing crack. <sighs> funny, funny talk. <laughs> you think so? You know I do stand up on Friday nights down around the corner. Why don't you come down and see me in about twenty years? Wait, you can't. You're a mental case. You can't get out of here. Wow, why are all these doctors assholes? Uh, clearly really, the... Doc. Haven't you ever cracked me? Just once? No. Clearly, like, this is for a person who hates doctors. Mm. It's great. Really? It's L.A., of course. Really? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Your freaking skull is cracked, funny man! This person, really, whoever wrote this, hates white people and doctors. Yeah. And also, yeah, apparently, hey, old black men. Yeah, I gotta get out of here. I'm already waiting in, in the hallway. She had that baby pretty okay. quick. Season. And she's on her feet holding the baby. <laughs> Now he finally gets out. Aww. You're so sweet. I love him. That baby, that baby is white! <laughs> I mean, you know. Imperator, if I have a baby, will you just be there when I get out with my baby? Just to, just to point out and say, that baby is white! <laughs> please, please say yes. What a cute baby. Thank you. Oh, what's his name? Ray Ray. <laughs> Ray Ray? <laughs> that child's legal name is Ray Ray. Oh, Lord. That's why black people can't get ahead. Could I hold him? Um, sure. You don't recognize your own ex? Nope. That mask. That little facial surgical mask. Doctor. Which would be sound like gold right now if we can get our hands on those. Hello. We don't have to I'm sell sorry, a mask, doctor. bro. You know what I got that's worth a thousand dollars right now? A half full bottle of Dawn dishwasher liquid. I'm that's sorry. What? Yeah. I guess I'll just have to erase this little steak. Clearly, because it's white. <laughs> Coronavirus mask hides everything. Don't, don't, don't. Roof. Come on, Raven. Come on, boy. Come on, Raven. <laughs> Look at that. Look, Look at, at that, that dog. <laughs> it's hidden bottle. Come on. Come on. Oh, God. 
Uh, what? You're still a baby doll. Yeah. Which I mean, it should be like fairly, but you know, still, it looks so bad. Hey, Ray. Now it's a real baby. Let's talk, huh? A real white baby. Put the baby down. You know what? You know it. What? The sins of the father, Ray. That are baby's like on the sun. six months old. That baby old as fuck. That baby ain't got no hair. Mind. Like black people be coming out with hair, Ray. Like. I came out with hair. Full head of hair. Man, this this motherfucker be having hair. Alright. Like, if we have a baby, it gonna have a lot of hair when it come out. This baby is six months old. This baby damn near a year old ain't got no hair. An eye for an eye and all that. I feel bad for white people too because they like they barely have any hair when they're born and they barely have any hair when they die. They got a good forty years of no hair. <laughs> they got a good forty years of hair. I could just end little Ray Ray now. I can just drop him. Watch his little old brains go splatter all over the nice hard concrete. I think that baby's the best actor in the movie. Appeared or Vegeta ever baby lie? Baby on the rooftop. The only redeeming character. Yeah, I uh, why is it? <laughs> drop. That's such an extreme. What do you want? What do I want? Yeah, see? Us browns, I we always got a lot of hair. I, want my I know where this back. one came from. That'd be nice. I think that's another reason I thought I had native blood. Yeah, because he, he got a lot of hair. And a full head of coal black hair. Yeah. For all the sleepless nights. I would love to go back in time and see this one as a baby. Drinking. The suicide attempt. Funny fog. There was a suicide attempt? What happened? It wasn't funny. He claims he attempted suicide, I guess. I want retribution! I want my life back! That'd be nice! Retribution, Ray. For all the sleepless nights. For the drugs, the drinking, the suicide attempt. What? When was all this? On the cutting room floor, I guess. Right? When did that happen? It wasn't funny. All I saw was him freaking out at his restaurant and killing three people. Revenge, my friend. That's the only way to fly. Karate kicks the baby out of his hand and into yours and then, like, push him up. You wanna fly? Huh? It's a nice roundhouse, so like you okay? hit it from behind, so it flies back at you. <laughs> I love his baby out. rescuing plan. You stay Great. right where you are, Ray. You'll survive a kick. It's like six months old. <laughs> All those months in the funny farm, Ray. I dreamt of somehow, some way, getting even. He's beyond my wildest dreams. <laughs> so today is your lucky day, mister. Because today you get to be on trial. But we're going to do it my way this time. Because, because this is my courtroom. And in my courtroom, I get to be the judge. And I get to be the jury. And Mr. Ray, I'm going to get to be your executioner. Okay, the baby's a baby doll again, right? So how do you plead, Mr. Ray? Yeah, I think so. What do you want? Let's see. <laughs> just, just use that scene all over again. Why don't you beg me? What? You heard me? Motherfucker, I can make another baby. Get down on your knees. I ain't even mine. And beg for the mercy <laughs> of this court. Are you willing to die for him, Ray? Come on. Let's go. Let's go. 
I am very frightened and confused. <laughs> no, no, Ray. No, Ray. <laughs> oh, so Ray, I call be that Lori. Yeah. Did you see, Mr. Ray. Put that I baby want on a piece the ground of you first. <laughs> You're gonna go fly for me, Mr. Ray! Huh? He should be fighting with the baby in his hands. Like that's the that that would be the best. Oops, stepped on the baby. <laughs> He's really stepping on the baby. Not <laughs> bad, Mr. Ray. Not bad. Hey, Mr. Ray! You. Now you can just leave. Yeah. Let the cops deal. Hey. You get the baby. No one's in it for any danger. Just Come on. leave. Nah, I gotta go up this flimsy ladder. It's some scaffolding. Clearly built by a deranged Fallout player like me. <laughs> This guy's been in a fucking mental asylum in a straight jacket for six months. Like, how in shape do you think he is? Not very at all. Maybe he's just secretly working out. She's no, seriously gonna just stand there? Yeah. Doing a straight jacket work. <laughs> yeah, didn't you know Jay Fonda had a straight jacket workout team? He's still standing there. Yep. Let's go back to this. Right! Oh, what's up? Okay. Oh, no, but this is like. For a martial arts movie, this is a terrible climactic fight because yeah. they're not really showing off martial arts. They're just, you know, they're just punching each other in a tiny confined space so they can't do any martial arts. Tina! Oh my god, oh my god! Run, Tina! Do something, Tina! Tina! See what a lame excuse for a man he is! You really still trying to get him back. Too late, Tina. It's not too late. <laughs> this is what's gonna happen if he and I break up. I'm only confined to a mental asylum for the next 25 years. It's not, not too, too late, late to get with me. <laughs> I'm 60. We can spend the rest of our lives together. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. That's it, I guess. All right. Yeah. Okay. Ray don't kill. Yeah, this is still better than all the Rini's fight scenes. <laughs> Go back. Oh Lord. I had my eyes closed. Go back. Yeah. Is that a Wilhelm scream? Yes, it was. Oh, boy. Look at that. Is he dabbing? Okay. Yep. <laughs> Dead man dabbing. <laughs> He's okay. He's okay, baby. <laughs> oh, He's shit. Okay. This is fantastic. City That's it! That's Stray. it! Stray, Kung Fu. <laughs> filthy, filthy, filthy. Rick, was that the other guy? Yeah. I guess. Who lord. So what do you think, Ray? Uh, Ray Ray was played by Diva. Who played that? Who played Black Doctor? I didn't know this was married. 
We finally found the mix of only yeah. one scrap. Yeah. So I got to pay my price and give our love respect. <laughs> Black Doctor, White Doctor. Kenneth Kid Ashburn. Love it. Love it. So, I will say this movie wasn't... Dojo Superboy. <laughs> Nightclub Fighters. I will say... Girl, uh, we'll, we'll get some of these credits. Leave, and leave, but let me make it up to you. Forgive me an even. Liquor Store. Well, give me one more Is that actually the name of the liquor store? I don't know. To put the twinkle back into your ebony eye. Undefeatable, did we, was that on? So bad, Undefeatable bad, bad? has been on both Good, Bad, 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 and um, Best, of the Worst. Best of the Worst. So yeah, we, we, we tend to we try to avoid movies that have been on other big yeah, we try to, we, our thing is to blow up our own shit. Yeah. Um, but we do take suggestions, so I appreciate that. Keep throwing them at us, we will take them. So in terms of, like, the general, like, feeling of this movie, it was so much. It was so much. And, like, you know, for us movies, you know, this is kind of a good time to say, for us movies, you know, have a real weird range, you know. Um... The worst thing that one of these movies can do for us is bore us. Yes. Which was the last movie we watched before. Like, this is the first one we've filmed or streamed or whatever, but <laughs> we do this a lot. Uh, you know, just, this is what we do on our little date nights. Uh, yeah, Evan and Arthur's a, oof. That's yeah, a movie. that's a movie. Uh, the last movie we watched was uh, Metal Storm, The Destruction of Jared Zinn. Something along those lines. Yeah, that's that's exactly it. Uh, we saw like a commercial for it somewhere else. Like a, we were watching an old commercial compilation, we, which is another thing. We also did. like commercial compilations. And so we saw like a 80s commercial compilation with a commercial for it. And we're like, wow, this looks great. And we watched it and it was just boring. It was so slow and like nothing made any sense. And like there really, like there was just a lot of like silence and like. There was no exposition. There was no lore dump. There was no way of knowing what was going on in this world. And there wasn't enough, like, funny, like, bad stuff going on to keep us entertained. It was just a lot of, like, just people looking at things, people driving, people fucking sitting in front of a fire. So this this movie, so, you know, our brain is kind of, the worst thing you can do is Boris. You know, we tend to like movies where there's a lot of funny, unintentional funny things happening. Um... So we, I, I would say I like it. It was confusing as all hell. Oh, I loved it. The editing was terrible. Like the pacing, there is no pacing. Um, it was it was out of this world, and I love it. It was just all over the place. This movie had no tone, like mm -mm. It, no cinematography. No, it had no no themes of any kind. Yeah, like. And it was great, like, because it was always weird and, like, the, you know, the writing was cringy, like, all the dialogue was super cringy, like, but in a, in a funny way that I enjoyed. Yeah. Um, there's a lot of moments where I was just like, ah, oh, no, and, like. Yeah, the, the best films, one of the reasons I like films, like, before, like, 2000 is because, like, bad movies are still using very questionable problematic language and so you, you get you get those and it's it's great it's a cautionary tale to not get pregnant yeah <laughs> it was porn yeah like so it was porn it was martial arts movie it was domestic squabbles fucking uh domestic violence sexual abortion, harassment sexual harassment like it was all over the place there were so many like b and c and d and e plots like it just moved from one, like, weird subplot to another. <coughs> and then, like, all the shit with his friends. Filthy getting a record deal. The girl that fucking... Cherry. The girl that Rick was dating becoming a famous movie yeah, star Cherry. in, like, six months. Like, it was just so much. And, like, and then I guess the master plan to get back with her was having Filthy do a song on the radio for her. 
And then that was it. And I guess it worked. Sort of. The fight is what worked. The fight worked. I think she was already ready to get back with him after hearing that song. Even though he didn't get to the hospital in time for the fucking, for the birth. Yeah, somehow. he's six months late. He's like, he's out of work. Like, I don't know, maybe he found another job. They just never, like, the fact that he had this office job. Yeah, we didn't that know we never first, established like, that. The movie, like, uh, I don't, I don't understand any of it. And it was fantastic. Yeah, it was great. I'm glad, I'm glad that you found this enjoyable, Crowley. We're going to try to. You know, do 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 this once a week, where especially you know with Corona and stuff, we may not be able to keep up with it once we like start working again. But certainly, like we would definitely like to do our our date night dumpster um, at least once a week, just to you know, just to spend it with y'all. Uh, yeah, he decided to become a male prostitute, and that's that's how that story ends. Yeah, we normally watch like a lot of like sci-fi and horror, uh, bad movies, a lot of action movies. Have we really watched a lot of action Not movies? Not straight action movies. Yeah, like a lot of like sci-fi action, post-apocalyptic action. Um, this was kind of like off-brand for us. This was. This was very off the beaten path. For but us. it looked so good when we like watched like a few seconds of it that it was like, okay. It yeah. was that turkey line that just, I had to. Yeah, so. Uh, but yeah, that was uh, City Dragon, 1995. Right. Um and uh, we both enjoyed it, so we both would recommend to anyone. So who would wants recommend to... if you're if you're doing, you know, Crowley, you have friends, uh, uh, Italian post apocalyptic, but yeah, yeah, we've seen Ooh. we've seen a lot of Italian, specifically Italian, but also some other post apocalyptic uh, B movies, and we have one that we're kind of saving as an ace in the hole at some point. Yeah, that's our that's our like that's the one that's gonna blow us up. Cause I don't think that one's Italian, but no, uh, but it's it's never no one's done it yet. No one knows about it. It's just I found it on my own one day, just kind of looking for bad movies by myself before we ever lived together, and I showed it to him, and I think we watched basically all of its sequels and stuff, and we were just like, this is this is great. Yeah. So um, we will, we will, uh, we will get to that one. That'll be kind of like our, you know, if we if we have to go back to work, we'll we'll do make that like our last episode or whatever, or before back to work episode. But it was, you know, I had a lot of fun. Um, I I would like to continue to do it. It's you know, this is something that we just do together, and so to get to share it with you guys is fun. Mm -hmm. So um, we will be back. Um, it was great being with you guys and, you know, as, as they say on good, bad or bad, bad, cause we haven't created a fucking, uh, tagline yet. Keep watching bad movies. There you go. We need to come up with like a rating system too or something or a way to like, yeah, a way to, yeah. You know, say what we think, but we'll, we'll get to that. We'll get to that. We'll get to that. Um, so 